Good morning, everybody. It's Dylan Skyline CrossFit, getting my morning routine going. I wanted to go over something that we have going this week. It's called Alumni Week. Alumni Week is a week where we invite all of our old members. So I went through uh, our, we use Zen Planner. So I went through Zen Planner and I uh, invited all the members that are no longer active members at our gym, which was close to 900 people. Just invited them back for this week, for Monday to Sunday, for a free week of workouts. Just kind of put the feelers out there, sent out a mass email about two weeks out, and then sent another email, slightly different in the way I wrote it. I uh, sent out another one, got a, about eight signups on the first email, and then I got about another six signups on the second email. And then so far, I think we're at 21 total people that have come in this week so far, and most of them multiple times. It's been a really good, successful week. I actually got two people already signed up for to actually come back but it's a really good there's a couple of things that it does first off there's some members coming in that were with me i've been we've been open for it'll be 11 years next month so i got members that come in came in that haven't been here in seven years and i will tell you what this is not the same gym that you came into seven years ago our coaching has gotten better our programming has gotten better everything's gotten better so it's a good way to kind of show them uh, um, how you've improved. Also, it kind of reminds them like why they started in the first place. It's been a really good time. It's almost been like a reunion week. You know, classes have been with new members. There's um, the OGs coming in, so it's really nice um, and, work, and it's been working out really well. So I would definitely push that maybe once a year i would definitely probably wouldn't do it unless you've probably been open more than probably two or three years but i have never done it so this is obviously probably going to be our most successful one but i'll definitely probably do this next year it's been really good um to see everybody and we're actually got a good little turnout too uh i'm just about to start writing on the whiteboard and i was thinking so these whiteboards are almost 10 years old and they look really good. And the reason why is because we don't use any solvents or cleaners on these. All we use is this, which is about one part vinegar to four parts water. So I looked online to look up some whiteboard cleaner and they were charging $36 a gallon. And I was like, I'm not paying that. So I looked up alternative and I found out distilled vinegar works just as good. So I pay a dollar to two dollars a gallon, put it put it in there, and then probably about a third of the way up, about right there is about how much vinegar I usually put in, and I put the rest water. Now I will tell you this the downside is it stinks. It smells like vinegar, but I only use it in the morning when no one's here, as you can see. And so by the time I'm clean, done cleaning the whiteboard and the fan's been turned on, the door's been open, like it, it's gone, it goes away. But yeah, if you spray this during class or like during um, when people are here, they're gonna be looking around like, what is that smell? So I only do it in the morning to clean the whiteboards off really nicely and then I rewrite everything. Uh, but during class and stuff, we just use a regular rag and just wipe it off. Uh, it's a little little tip to save you some money. The whiteboard and a big thing is with this vinegar is it doesn't dissolve the finish on your whiteboard. So it's bleach and um, Windex and any kind of cleaner will, will start dissolving that smooth and it gets harder and harder to erase. These boards are great. We can still use whiteboard erasers on them and uh, we use the big markers. You know, everyone always, I've always, people always tell me never use red because red will stain, stain your whiteboard. Not if you use vinegar. It works great. 
that's it for today, guys. The uh, alumni week has been a success so far. We still have more people signing up. I think we're at 21 people for the week. I think it'll probably, by the time the week's over, it'll be between 25 and 30. So definitely recommend it. Until next time, talk to you guys later.